Hi guys, Neil at Italia Autos here and welcome back to the final video on the Jap Import GTA. It's all finished now, it's all ready to go up for sale. So let's have a quick walk around it and um, we can see what extras we've done since I last finished filming. So guys, the GTA is all done. I've done a few more things since we finished last filming. I've had the wheels refurbished because they were rather dull. So they're all looking really good. It's got four really good tyres on it. I've detailed the engine bay a little bit so that's looking a lot neater and tidier. Um, giving the car a good polish. So all that's left to do now is get it up for sale. So here we are guys, we're all done. Everything has been done, tested, MOT'd, cleaned, put back together, double tested again. Uh, it drives beautifully, gear selection's beautiful. It went through some MOT with zero issues at all. Typically, as soon as I've polished it, parked it outside for five minutes and it started to rain, which is really annoying, but uh, it does show the, uh, the beading on the paintwork. I mean, the interior is pretty much immaculate. Yes, it's still got my dirty floor mat in there because I'm still going to be in and outside of it with my dirty feet. Do you need to clean the glove box lid still? So as you can hear, the engine is now all done and running really good. I did have a few little teething problems as I said at the end in the last video. Uh, had a little bit of a coolant leak just coming from the other side of the thermostat. Just needed resealing and that was all perfectly fine. And I also had a problem with the Selly Speed gear selection being a little bit rough and not as smooth as I'd like it to be. It just needed bleeding again, so a quick bleed and a recalibration later using the multi-ECU scan software. And it was all perfect, brilliant, ready to go. So the big question now is how much is it worth? I'm seeing these for sale for anywhere between eight and 16,000 pounds. This is a Japanese import. It's done 53,000 miles, full MOT, full engine rebuild, full respray. You know, it doesn't really want for any more. It's got a few mods with the exhaust and things like that. Drives really nicely. So let me know in the comments below what you think about it. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed this series, but uh, yeah, here we have another one all finished. Thanks for watching.